I'm gonna teach you how to use peck pierce for marking center of your hole. Uh, so you can go back and later drill it and you'll have the location of the hole in the perfect size. First, we'll grab our contour tool, grab our holes, right click and then move them to a new layer. We're gonna call that holes. Then grab the outside of the part, move it to a layer called outside. Now our first operation to peck the holes, we're going to use a drilling process instead of plasma. So select the drilling operation, we'll select the layer holes. <coughs> select the tool of the material that we're going to be using. For me, I'm going to be using 10 gauge today. And so we'll select that tool. You have to make the max, size, max hole size bigger than the size of the hole that you're peck piercing. Our holes in the drawing is one inch, so we'll put 1.5 for the max hole size. Then you hit okay. So now you can see the tool path here. It's gonna go from zero. It's gonna peck this hole first, then this one, this one, and this one. Then the next thing we do, we go back and make a jet cutting operation for plasma. We'll pick outside offset, and then we'll pick the layer we named outside. Pick our tool, and make sure all your other settings here are the way you want them, and then you hit okay. So now what you see is gonna peck the holes first and then it'll cut the perimeter of the part from there you'd save it just like you always do and then run your post processor and save your g-code